Team sh Okay. It's a go. Okay, good luck. What is up, everybody? We have uh, Ketchup Man 7 here commentating, not with you boys, Starboy, which is unfortunate, but that's because Starboy is over here going to be doing work with Rush, but we also have Avoca and Lavin, who so far who uh, stumped Cox, Team Cox, uh, with uh, Cygnus. And they're jumping into it starting Smashville, or Town City, not surprising at all. Um, and it looks like we got the, the classic Mario Brothers versus the Fire Emblem duo, which uh, I absolutely love this concept. It's really, really cool. Uh, so props to both of them for doing this. And right now, uh, my eyes are actually drawn to Avoca and Rush because they're... Uh, their confrontation. Oh, okay. So I thought he was gonna follow up. He was quick to try it, but uh, did not. And is that a game? <laughs> Starboy. Starboy loves doing the game. Um, so uh, the the reason I'm unsure about this matchup. And wow, that's already a stock from uh, Voka. That's unfortunate. Um, because Avoca is a great Robin player and he knows exactly what he's doing. But how good is Robin in doubles? Well, <laughs> apparently really good with that uh, knockback. Um, but the the issue I see here is actually uh, for Team Starboy and Rush is they can get walled out, yeah, and no Sparatu or something. Uh, walled out by projectiles with Robin, which can be countered by Cape, but they're also, but uh, swords, you know, disjoints just give them issues. But at the same time, uh, good frame data and invincible up smash, both of them have. So it can go either way, I feel. I feel it's going to be a very uh, push-pull. Uh, right now, Starboy yet to die. Everyone else taking a stock. Uh, look at with the sweet back air. It looks like, oh, wow. And that was another stock. I was looking over at Evoca. I was back to, actually about to say, Evoca's follow-ups have been very consistent and clean so far. Um, and it's been actually a uh, pleasure to see because I don't, I didn't even know I haven't had a Martha's. Oh, that's the up smash. There it is. Uh, and now... Both teams have one player at one stock. Starboy still yet to lose a stock. He really like he really knows how to play against Fire Emblem characters, um, and that's an unfortunate SD for me. Um, so he made that matchup experience, except for Robin. But maybe the matchup experience and the fact that he's going specifically from wow. Even when caped, Avoca knew he's three steps ahead, just like his character. Brilliant. Um, so, Lavin here, um, looks like he's trying to get something going, and the problem with Fire Emblem characters is landing is always just a big problem, especially with Marth. Tries to get the spike, gets the stage spike, but not enough to actually kill Starboy. Uh, oh, what? Oh, Lavin tried to follow up. That would have been crazy. Okay, he's trying to edge guard him, but to, to no avail. Uh, good spot dodge to not get up I don't with rage. I don't. I still don't think it would have killed. And another follow up back air. And now because of that they have to share stock. So both teams have one stock to one stock, except high percentage. And that's that's it for Marth. It's up to Avoca to somehow bring up. Nope, that's the cape. Remember, Starboy loves capes. And um, I feel like I'm not giving enough credit to rush that game for the absolute brutal damage he was adding on through his combo game and mind games. One thing Rush is really, really good at is knowing frame data, how to bait, and just overall mind games. He'll condition you and punish you. Not even hard. Okay, we got a, 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 a character switch. Latin actually going cloud. No longer Fire Emblem boys, just anime boys. Um, so, and evoke a color change, maybe getting that confidence in. So that's completely understandable. Or not. Okay, well, still anime boys, I guess. You know, pretty pretty boys. Team pretty boys here. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. Uh, so that... Da, 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 da. Here we go. So... I'm not used to this mouse. Ah, that mechanical keyboard is beautiful. I love that noise. Uh... Starboy and Rush taking game one, obviously, as we've seen, and we're gonna go in. Any, any counter picks, or are we going back to Smashville? Um, honestly, I'm a little tired of seeing just consistent Smashville and doubles, but I think it is the best stage overall for it. Um, but maybe they'll go something more comfortable. Um, 
<laughs> With the link? They're, they're talking about it right now. Uh, I don't think they actually banned anything. Starboy and Rush? No bans? They're, they're talking about it. Um, but uh, the thing with Rush that I was trying to say earlier is he'll uh, get you with the mind games and absolutely punish you. He won't even punish you hard, but he'll punish you consistently. So he'll add that damage uh, over the span of a minute, and he'll take reduced damage because of it. Um, he's really good at that, and as I say, look at that. Like, who does that? He just starts in with the down special and then up smash, and um, now the down tilt... Uh, Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, the damage on Link, I feel so bad for Lavin. No way, don't do it, don't, okay, Starboy. You know, I saw what you were going for, it was cute. Lavin saying, no, no, I'm refusing. And Robin at 86, I didn't even notice that, I was too busy looking at Lavin. Um, getting the, uh, getting all those combos, but Nas adding a little bit of damage that is needed for Mario, as well as healing himself. Um, the damage it actually heals dep is dependent on the both the percentage of the opponent and the percentage of Robin. Um, and a beer versus Art Fire. Uh, but uh, no, nothing really special, but an up smash. See, the thing is, is Link with Rage can kill ridiculously early, but Rush is trying to get rid of that. Uh, it's Town and City, so he's, he probably has a better chance. Oh! And that was the spike, and that's the that's the thing with Rush. He knows how to condition you to recover in a way you're not comfortable with, and he'll punch you for it. What? Was that the first hit of up special? No, that was up tilt? Apparently that was up tilt. I thought that was the first hit of up special, and it immediately got canceled. Um, no, Rush. Okay, okay. Maybe back to him, that would have been good. Okay, what is happening? Is Rush there? No, he had to jump. Oh, but speaking dead, it looks like uh, Starboy got caught in the uh, Arc Thunder. Uh, to Ford Smash, which is interesting. There's uh, something called Ignis, and basically at certain percents for specific characters, is that that's not a dead, uh, that's not a dead Robin. Both of these characters are actually rather heavy, Link and Robin, which I think makes them a great character pick for a situation like this, because I don't think Marth would have been... I think with the matchup experience uh, they both, uh, Rush and Starboy have, I don't think Marth was like the ideal pick. But that's fine. It's whatever uh, Lavin is comfortable with. So, uh, the thing with Ignis is at certain percents for certain characters, if you land Arc Thunder and you can- Oh, Thorin accidentally missing everyone except for the teammate. Oh, but catching it with the up air, getting his, uh, getting his, uh, forgiveness, I guess, of his sin of <laughs> betraying his teammate. That was so eccentric. Um, and if you hit them with a the down air at certain percents with the, uh, with the Levin Sword, then it'll send them at a almost perf low horizontal angle, just a really dirty angle, and it's really easy to gimp with it. And um, nonetheless, though, despite their best efforts, even though they, I feel at least they're doing better. Oh, that was that was unnecessary. Unless that was meant for uh, Lavin, which is very possible. Um, Rush is just gonna bait something out. Just watch. He's gonna do it. He's gonna he's gonna get him to do something dumb, and then he's gonna punish him for it. Oh, a misfire. Okay. Yeah, that's... Okay. I, I need to start paying attention to Starboy and Lavin because there's something going on there. Oh, there is something going on there. And what is going on there is a dunk on Lavin. So unfortunate. And maybe another? Nope. Uh, so Avoga, if there's one thing about Avoga, he, he refuses it. No, he can refuse to give up, but that does not... That does not mean that they will consistently win, and that means Starboy and Rush going to take game two. Uh, so good stuff. Oh, let me hear that mechanical keyboard. Yeah. Oh, it's delectable. Uh, another character switch coming from Avoka and Lavin. Uh, really, just from Lavin. Toon Link. Okay. Lavin's Toon Link is something special. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, what's up? Yo, that's good. Uh, yeah. Alright, sorry for that commentary. This is the local Walmart um, main thing. Anmar. <laughs> Peace out. And Peace out, he says. Love Mario, man. So cool. Um, so. Aaron's Toon Link, luckily they waited until I was done with the bracket to get started. Aaron's Toon Link, um, 
while this may seem worse in hindsight, I feel like this is the better option. He's more comfortable with this character, and he's gotten more work done. Um, and Starboy tries to go for cute stuff like that. He loves jumping off stage and trying to get footstool. Um, and a lot of times it'll work. So we're going to see, I feel like Glavin's going to be uh, rather aggressive this game, despite being Toon Link, uh, just to give Avoka time to charge Arc and get most of his combos going. And Avoka going off stage, trying to get the stage spike, but instead hitting him a little too high, or Rush DIing really well for it, loses the Eleven Sword, and gets up smashed as a, uh, as a punish for trying to throw something up. So, uh, Avoka still likes using the uh, Bronze Sword, and just gets Levin back the guys, moment down smash. Okay, here here we go. We have we have Ray. What what happened, Ray? Give us the run. Uh, Give us we the play won game one and losers, and then I switched to Rob and bodied them. You bodied them. Bodied. Like, Unfortunate. Human centipede three body. What was the score? 1 2? 2 0. 2 0? Okay. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Sorry about that. I had to uh, set the bracket up. Okay, so what did I miss? Um, actually, it's almost even if they can just get rid of that one stock, which Lavin is going to do and trying to go over that spike. Uh, I respect it completely. Oh, uh, I uh, I like commentating. It's fun. Um, so essentially, what we have here is oh, he tried to get Ignis, and that was a really yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, and Starboy trying to get the trying to get the cape, uh, but uh, go in the back here. Is he gonna go for the cape again? Or is he gonna go for a drop down? No, he's actually trying to mind game him and condition him into just like fearing him. Maybe uh maybe go for an air dodge read later on. Uh, I don't know. Because essentially what to, what Nate likes to do is he likes to take that, oh, so this is what they're gonna do to counter this, and he stores it in the back of his head like a little vault. And he locks that in and he's like, Well, I'll just do this next time to do that. And if you don't prepare for that, you will lose a stock. Um And the the thing with uh with Lavin is his tech skill with Toon Link is super impressive. I've seen him do things I didn't even know Toon Link could do, and it, you would think a character with almost no punishable moves on shield uh, wouldn't be so fast, but the way he plays him is just excellent. Um, so we, we actually have him at 163. They're actually in the lead right now. The uh, I'm waiting for a down smash or a back throw from Starboy, or an up smash, it's Mario, of course, so an up smash. Uh, so, but that's okay. They can they can do this. I believe uh, Lavin and Avoka can actually bring this back. Avoka, if he just gets, oh, I didn't get the spike yet, but uh, Sorry didn't get the cape, so that's something. Uh, Rush is over here just trying to deal damage to Avoka. Get him out of there, and he is out of there. Um, and now uh, Uppy. Okay, what are they doing now? They're they're okay. They're trying to uh, they're trying to get clips. I see. Um, and that's it. That's another up B, and uh, that will be a 3-0. Starboy and Rush versus Avoka and Lavin. Starboy and Rush will move on. Avoka uh, and Lavin will be sent to losers.